It's Hard for Me to Live with Me, a memoir by Rex Chapman, is an introspective and candid account of the life of the former professional basketball player, from his rise to fame in the sports world to his struggles with addiction and personal demons. Recounted in the first person, Chapman provides a raw and unfiltered glimpse into the various stages of his life, offering readers an understanding of the challenges and triumphs that have marked his journey. Chapman begins with his early life in Kentucky, where he was raised in a basketball-loving household. His father, Wayne Chapman, was a basketball coach, which influenced Rex's love for the game from an early age. Displaying immense talent, Chapman quickly became a local high school hero and was touted as one of the best players in the nation. His prowess on the court earned him a scholarship at the University of Kentucky, where he continued to excel, achieving remarkable success and setting himself up for a promising career in the NBA. Entering the 1988 NBA draft after his sophomore year, Chapman was selected as the eighth overall pick by the Charlotte Hornets. His transition to professional basketball came with its share of challenges. Chapman describes the pressure to perform, the rigorous travel schedule, and the physical demands of the game. He also highlights the unique experience of being a white player in a predominantly black sport, touching on issues of race and how it influenced his interactions on and off the court. Throughout his NBA career, Chapman played for several teams including the Washington Bullets, Miami Heat, and Phoenix Suns, among others. He was known for his sharp shooting ability and his high-flying dunks, which often electrified fans and gained him a dedicated following. His achievements on the court are recounted with a sense of pride, but Chapman does not shy away from discussing the darker sides of professional sports, such as the pressure to win, the culture of masculinity, and the toll taken on athletes' bodies and minds. Chapman's memoir addresses his personal life in detail, sharing the highs and lows of his relationships, the joy of fatherhood, and the struggles with maintaining a balance between his professional and personal life. Tragically, injury and chronic pain became a significant theme in his story as he dealt with multiple surgeries and the physical aftermath of his basketball career. Chapman's reliance on painkillers to manage chronic discomfort evolved into a full-blown addiction, which he speaks about with startling honesty. The memoir delves deeply into Chapman's battles with opioid addiction, detailing how it began insidiously and then spiraled out of control. This addiction consumed his life and led to a highly publicized arrest for shoplifting, an event that marked a turning point in Chapman's life. The shame and embarrassment of this event combined with the support of his family and friends, propelled him towards seeking help and finally addressing his addiction. Chapman's path to recovery is a prominent theme in the latter part of the memoir. He is open about the challenges he faced in rehab, the mental and emotional work required to overcome his dependency, and the ongoing process of healing and making amends. His journey includes moments of revelation, healing, and personal growth, as he begins to forge a new identity outside of basketball and addiction. Through his experiences, Chapman discusses the broader issue of substance abuse and mental health in professional sports, shedding light on the need for better support systems for athletes. He advocates for greater awareness and resources to help those struggling with addiction and the importance of breaking the stigma associated with mental health issues. After completing rehab, Chapman works towards rebuilding his life and restoring his relationships, particularly with his children. He reflects on the lessons learned through his experiences with addiction and the importance of vulnerability, self-reflection, and accountability. The memoir is, at its core, a story of redemption and hope as Chapman finds purpose in helping others, using his platform to raise awareness about the dangers of opioid abuse and the possibility of recovery. As the memoir draws to a close, Chapman shares his ongoing commitment to sobriety and his dedication to living a more authentic and fulfilling life. He has become an advocate for mental health and addiction recovery, speaking openly about his struggles in the hope that his story will inspire others to seek help. His transformation from an admired athlete to a humbled survivor offers a powerful testament to the resilience of the human spirit in the face of adversity. It's Hard for Me to Live with Me, a memoir, 
concludes with Chapman looking towards the future with cautious optimism, recognizing the daily commitment required to maintain his sobriety and the need to continue working on himself. His story serves as both a cautionary tale and a beacon of hope for anyone facing similar trials, ultimately affirming the possibility of change and the redemptive power of self-discovery and inner strength. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.